The Danbury Animal Welfare Society, or DAWS, is a successful nonprofit volunteer run organization that provides rescue and adoption for both dogs and cats. DAWS houses 30 to 32 dogs and 65 cats, and DAWS has its very own full blown clinic complete with veterinary technicians on staff for examining all Dawes animals. Dawes is dedicated to improving the lives of animals in our community and beyond. Their vision is to be the regional leader in placing dogs and cats in qualified adoptive homes. A lot of people still go to pet stores and buy dogs. What we're trying to do, a lot of us say around here, is adopt, don't shop. Um, we're getting more advertising the word advertising, we're getting more awareness of going to a shelter and adopting a homeless dog as opposed to going to a pet store. After arriving at Dawes, the dogs undergo an evaluation performed by Bruce Kaplan, the training director at Dawes. What we're doing today is dogs come in uh, on a transport uh, rescued, in this case from Bowling Green, Kentucky. We need to do a behavioral evaluation ourselves to make sure uh, the dogs are appropriately socialized, what their um, their abilities are as far as behaviors, sit, stay, obedience, things like that. Um, their temperament, are they, are they outgoing, are they shy? So what I'm doing when you see me handle the dog, try food, things like that, we're testing for food aggression. Uh, with the touch, we're testing for uh, a tolerance to being manipulated or touched, uh, gently restrained, all things that the dog's gonna have to deal with uh, in their life. The dogs are kept in a large line of kennels that stretch from one side of the building to the other. Throughout the day, the dogs are fed, walked, bathed, and cared for by volunteers. We come in in the morning, uh, we do a walkthrough to make sure all our animals are healthy. Myself, I have a kennel manager and I have a cat supervisor. Then they begin feeding, medicating, and cleaning. That's pretty much the day of the staff. Also, the dogs are free to play and socialize on a regular basis. The Dawes personnel are loving and caring, so each dog is treated well during this transitional period as he waits in the hope of being adopted soon. Last year we adopted about 365 dogs. Uh, that's quite an increase from the previous year. Every year it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. This year our goal is 385 dogs to adopt out. The first step in the adoption process is promoting the dogs. Potential families can see all available dogs online at the Dawes website or they can flip through a tangible catalog that profiles each and every dog that is eligible to be adopted. When these families find a dog that they are interested in, Dawes personnel introduce the family to the furry friend in the hopes that the relationship is a match. At these meetings, the dogs are walked, petted, and nurtured in order to see how the dog interacts with the family and how that family interacts with the dog. If there is a true connection, the family must then apply for the dog. It takes about a week to process the application. We ask for a vet reference and two personal references. Okay. And, um, you know, the application is pretty in-depth if you've filled out any other ones in any other places. I'm sure you're going to be, you know, how long have you lived at the house, and what kind of fence do you have, how long the dog, would the dog be left alone, all that stuff. Um, you know, and then we have volunteers that call our personal references, call your vet references. Um, and then, you know, if the application is approved, they'll give you a call, set up a time for you to come pick them up. Every application is thoroughly looked over in order to give the dogs the best chance at having a happy, healthy life with a new loving family. If the application is approved, the family comes to pick the dog up to bring it to its new home. I think it's important to rescue the dog um, instead of uh, going with a the, with the, with the natural breed. Just because these, these dogs are given a second chance. I think it's important to do that. The feeling of seeing a dog walk out the doors of Dawes is bittersweet, but the sadness of seeing that dog go is overshadowed by the happiness that the dog will have in its new loving home. Dawes is forever expanding their mission and their vision to promote animal welfare while always including the community in their endeavors. Dawes is truly making a difference one animal at a time. And the irony of all ironies is that for each ounce of happiness that Dawes brings its dogs, those dogs bring twice the amount of happiness to their new families.